Hello Aries, welcome to Visions of Light and Love. This is your reading for the energy in May. This reading will be for my Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If you are a returning viewer, welcome back. And if this is your first time stopping by, welcome to Visions of Light and Love. If the reading does not resonate with your situation, check out your Moon, Venus, and Rising Sun video. Cross watchers are welcome as well. If you like my energy, my vibe, you connect with this reading and you want to show some support to this channel, hit the subscription link if you have not already, along with the notification bell so that you are notified when new videos are posted. Also, hit the thumbs up image to help the video circulate for something more private, more detailed and specific to your situation. The link to the email address will be posted in the description box below. Also, watch this video to the end to hear what the giveaway is for you guys helping me reach 5,000, hitting the 5,000 mark. Watch the video to the end to hear the giveaway. Or, yeah. All right, so let's see what's going on with you, Aries. All right, Aries. All right, so someone or somebody, someone or you have this person on your mind you may um, receive a message stating that someone wants to nurture something with you with this harvest. Someone um, have a gift for you. Someone has you on their mind. They may be calling, telling you they miss you, they love you, they want to see you. But with harvest coming out as your um, overall energy, I'm seeing that some of you could be reaping the rewards for the work that you are putting in. Some of you are reaping the rewards, reaping what you sold, or someone could be reaping what they sold. You may have isolated yourself with from this person, um, blocked your heart chakra. You may not be talking to this person at this time. You may have turned your head to what they have to say, what they want to do, and it's because you love yourself. But I'm seeing this person coming in with a message. Some of you have messages coming in. This person may be telling you that they have a gift. They love you. They miss you. But I feel like some of you put this person out in the cold. Some of you, if this person was living with you, you um took your keys back. Or you put them out, locked your door. <clears throat> and this person may be experience some, experiencing some type of financial hardship while you're all happy and focusing on your money. Let me know in the comment section below if this is you. Okay, I feel like it took you a long time to come to this place, Aries, but you've made a decision that you were going, you're going to cut this person off. This person is cut off. I see that you listen to your intuition. Person could be a Cancer or a Pisces, but you have the victory now. This person was causing you to have headaches, couldn't sleep at night, you were up feeling defeated, and now you feel victorious. And again, it took you some time to come to this place, but I feel like you picked your bags. Or you made them pack their bags and walk away from this. What is the energy for the sign of Aries? Okay. Yeah, some of you were definitely dealing with the cancer with that chariot card. But again, you moved on from this person. You knew your worth. You know your worth. You know what you bring to the table. You know your value. This person like getting attention from other people. Okay like getting attention from other people and again you decided you made a conscious decision okay so this person may have had you in a third party as well but i'm saying that you made a conscious decision to distance yourself from this person and now they want to come back towards you this person is spying on you checking out your social media page driving past your home asking people about you this person is spying on you okay could be an Aquarius, a Leo, a Scorpio, or a Taurus. Yeah, and they're spying on you, but they're still juggling. Spying on you, but still juggling multiple people and multiple things, but trying to work things out with you all at the same time. That, and you're holding back. You're like, no, I know what you're doing. I see what you're doing. I'm, I'm, I cut you off, and I'm not going to let you back into my space. They may be coming back in 
for um to have sex and that's the part that you are not aware of if this person is contacting you saying anything pertaining to sex they want to come in to have sex they're going to try to manipulate you through the act of sex is what i just heard they're going to say that they want to work things out. They want stability. They want to be with you, possibly marry you. But this person is not telling the truth. This person has uh, an agenda. They have a motive. And the motive is to use sex to wheel you back in, which will be manipulation, so that they can keep you stuck with that hangman energy, Pisces energy. This person wants to keep you stuck. Okay, I see you've moved on towards peace and harmony, but again, I'm seeing a conversation taking place and I'm seeing that in this conversation, the person that you are were dealing with or the person that you cut off, this person is going to try to communicate in a way because this, um, this person knows how you are is what I'm hearing and they know how to manipulate. You're going to have to be strong with the strength card Leo's energy to own to, um, be able to see and hear that this person means you no good okay with the star card spirit of saying use your intuition it's time for you to heal it's time for you to um aquarius energy is here it's time for you to heal it's time for you to move on quickly run away as fast as this person comes in in order to bring forth justice balance in your life because this person is a trickster they're trying to um um this person is trying to manifest a reconnection with you because i do see that they love you they do love you but they're still deceptive seven of swords this person is still deceptive and aries that is your energy so this person this person could also be controlling from what I'm seeing, someone here is controlling. Yep. They're going to try to come back in. They want to control the situation, come back in, and reconcile with you. Some of you have children with this person. Let me know if you have children with them. And I'm going to pull some love oracle cards to see what else the cards have to say. But so far, that is what I'm seeing. Okay, so um, what I wanted to say about the um, giveaway. The giveaway is posted on the community section of this channel. Okay, so check out the community section of this channel. Follow all of the steps to be considered for the giveaway. Alright, so I'm seeing, yeah, you've moved on. This person... Could have been talking about you to family and friends or um and that's what caused the breakup this person was saying some bad things about you and now they want to come in and have a co uh, conversation after this breakup or se separation they're trying to swindle their way back in i'm so glad i'm home i was on vacation and vacation is always nice but being home is better paradise yeah, so they're going to try to come back and you make this person happy. You bring them joy. But this person with this golden mirror is a narcissist. They're not in your lead. They mean you no good. And Spirit is saying, take this time out to heal from this broken heart. Okay. Someone here may have green fingernail polish, pink fingernail polish, tan, or like a new color or yellow. Okay. But yeah, um, Aries, this is your reading comment below let me know if this is your story share like subscribe hit the notification bell be safe i'm sending you love light peace and healing energy thank you for watching enjoy the rest of your week and i will see you next time bye